I never want to jump right to the spins and everything. Like, that's fine. But if you don't have the basics, you're going to look crazy. Okay? You're going to hurt yourself, too. So. Shut up and sit down. Alright, so one of the first moves we're gonna get started with, I called them, and no, I've named all these moves my own names. They could have like proper names that other people actually acknowledge them as, but it's just what I call them. Uh, but this number one move is called one twos. So essentially, all this is gonna help you do is one, get your balance, specifically on individual skates. And so you're gonna practice basically balancing on one skate at a time and doing it at speed. Um, of course, we're gonna start at a slow speed to start, but then as we continue to build up on it, you know, you wanna try to increase it, go as fast as you can. Uh, that way you can work on just getting more familiar with your own balance, uh, which skate you're more familiar with, which, with which one of your feet you need more help with as well. Uh, so one, two is very simple. Uh, let's walk through it really quickly so I can show you. So like I just mentioned, it is for you to get more comfortable with your skates. And literally, you know, you want to be as comfortable as possible. You want eight different wheels, especially if you're new to this. It's, it's weird. Yeah, it's weird. So to start, all I want you to do, which I'll show you, is lifting up your knee. That's it. If you've ever done high knees before, it's like the same movement. And of course, start low at first. You don't have to lift it up as high as I am to start. Um, you could do it like an inch off the ground and then try to get up as high as you can, like up to two feet, like I'm showing here. And then hold it for a little bit longer just so you can get more familiar with that, right? So now we're going to move into what the one twos actually look like. Literally all it is is picking up your foot behind you. And again, your goal here is really just to stay in place, pick it up behind you, just feeling more comfortable picking it up. You can think like you're an ice skater. You can put your arms out just to help you balance as well. That'll help you get you moving as well. Now this last piece is to get you comfortable with actually moving. And in my opinion, I think it's a lot easier once you start moving versus doing it stationary. So if you're a little scared about moving yet, don't worry, it's okay. Just take your time and remember, you don't have to pick your foot up as high as I am. Start low, right? And don't remember, don't forget, excuse me, to use your knees, right? Um, so once you start moving and you're getting your legs going, um, and we'll do them both. So I'm going back right now to show you to pick up your knee in the front first. I think that's a little bit easier for people to start and then go back and do uh, the actual one twos. But of course, going slowly, which I'll show you next. So just a quick note, notice that when I wasn't moving, I was going forward and back with my skates. Right. But if you're actually trying to move, you want to make sure that you're using the side of your skate to actually push off because you need that friction to be able to go forward. So right here, I'm just showing you to try to use the sides of your skates before if you're actually trying to move forward and as you're trying to get like go faster you'll see that you'll have to do that more to get more comfortable with it so that's what this movement is So like I said before, uh, specifically with the one twos, try to of course start slow, but your goal is to try to pick up speed as you go. Um, so I'm gonna run through and just do a quick little speed check for each of them. First, I'm gonna start with just lifting up my leg uh, forwards, then I'll go backwards, and I'll specifically do the one twos and the voiceover will kind of keep up with the actual pace of the numbers as we go, right? So this is strictly just for speed um, and you'll see what I mean as we go through. This is round one, knee in the front. Just take it slow and just focus on picking your knee up. Now we're gonna speed this up and this is still knee up in the front.
All right, let's put those one twos to work, but let's take it slow. All right, working your way, one twos, but a little faster. So after further review, I realized that probably pushing together crossovers, the combo that I came up with all together in one video is going to be a lot. So for this video specifically, we're just going to do basic stuff. One, twos, and then we'll start with entry level crossovers, okay? Yeah, we're not doing that. So basically for the rest of this video, we're just going to go over one, twos. I'm going to do it at speed. We're going to do, I'm going to link in the other video for the crossover beginning and this man is just talking ignore him yeah it's me y'all i know it doesn't matter that much all right um but yeah he lied again don't worry about it so now i'm gonna skip ahead to uh what it looks like at speed uh one of my pupils that i have she's going to demonstrate it for you and yeah Oof, yep. Just wanted to show, as you pick your feet up higher, it does become more difficult. So just make sure you take your time, as she saw. But she got it together, y'all. No worries. But nonetheless, appreciate y'all watching. <laughs>